What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be teaching you how to play MCC Island tournaments, how they work, and everything you should know about them. I hope you enjoy the video. Also, before this video begins, uh, it turns out that actually quite a small percentage of you guys are actually subscribed, so please consider subscribing, it's free, anyone can do it, you can unsubscribe later if you really want to, but yeah, enjoy the video. Okay, so in this video I'm going to be going over three points. Number one, what an MCC Island tournament is. Number two, how MCC Island tournaments work. And number three, how to play in MCC Island tournaments. There will be timestamps on the screen of where to go for each of these points. So without further ado, let's get on to point number one. An MCC Island tournament is where groups of two to four players go against at least two other teams in a highest points wins competition. Typically in a tournament you are asked to play three rounds of four MCC Island games. And this goes on to point number two. Obviously, MCC Island has more games than just four. As of right now, there are six games that can be played. There are many ways the games can be decided. First of all, player voting. Through Discord, the owner will type a poll on what game the players want first. Then, after the first game is decided, they vote for which game they want second. This goes on until all four games have been decided and the game order is decided as well. This method is also used for the weighted wheel method. The weighted wheel method is where the amount of votes in the game corresponds to the percentage of chance that the game is picked. Now, this probably sounds really confusing to you, but it really will make sense later on. The last method is a wheel randomizer. No players can vote or influence the vote on which game it was played. This is supposedly the most fair option. Now after all of that, you're probably wondering why the game order matters, and this is similar to MCC. The game order matters because the later games have higher multipliers, however, don't be confused, the game's multipliers only go towards your team scores. Your individual score does not take any effect of the multipliers. This is about to get really, really confusing. Well, if you haven't played on a tournament before, of course. Sky Battle and Parkour Warrior are two games that have low scores. To compare, one win in a full game of Hall will give 700 coins, whereas one win in a full game of Parkour Warrior gives 422 coins, and a 5 kill win in Sky Battle gives 356 coins. Clearly, those scores are drastically lower than Hole in the Wall. This is only important towards the multipliers. For example, a multiplier on Sky Battle and Parkour Warrior would be much higher than a multiplier on Hole in the Wall. You may raise the question, how do the scorers know what score you got? Every time your team dies, one of your team members has to take a screenshot of the tab list. In Sky Battle, every single one of your team has to take a screenshot because the tab list doesn't show the score you got. Once you have your screenshots, you send them into your team's designated team chat. All scorers have a shared spreadsheet. The spreadsheet calculates your team score and your individual score. After the tournament's finished, they will announce the team scores and individual scores. The top two teams will enter dodgeball or dineable. Okay, so now we've gone over most of the information. I hope you took notes. Here is a video that I'm going to be analysing of a tournament that I played in the other day. Alright, so in this tournament, I'm teamed with three people called Droid, Penguin Plays, and Seabot. At least Seabot got a kill. <laughs> Yeah, okay, screenshot, that's okay, it's just, it's a fr Now you'll notice instantly the droid says to screenshot. This is because everyone on our team has died and we are playing Sky Battle. In this analysis, I will be skipping into key points on where I will be demonstrating on what I said before. But I'll also be putting in cool and funny moments just for the fun. So Sky Battle, it's always the same. Yeah, I'm so... You got a TNT? Oh my god, oh my god, droid, you're amazing. Okay, listen, here is a really good strategy in order to get the highest coins possible. And I know it may seem like basic logic, but when you're picking the game order, make sure that you go for your weakest games first. I didn't take part in the game order, but luckily, everyone voted for my worst games first and my best games last. I hate Parkour Warriors so fucking much. I mean, it was, it's a you team. Fin you finish your Parkour? No. <laughs> Honestly. Can't believe you do that, Jordan. That's is so it a crazy. team? Uh, watch this. In two minutes, only only five people left. <laughs> okay, we should be bad. fine. We should be fine. We should be fine. And I'm not right there. Oh, we're top three. Well, top I know. probably could have got top. We probably could have got first and third, fourth. If we just get I nice know. modifiers and we don't oh, win each shit. other. Oh, shit. Okay, sorry. Bro, go away, zombie. Zombie, go away. We got us down. That's very good. Do you think I get top one in Hollow and one then? I believe. Uh, maybe. <laughs> Okay, to be honest, this last game seriously doesn't matter. I think you understand the point. 
Now luckily I recorded an event where I actually got dodgeball in so I can show you how this works. Basically there's an external server called MC Brawls where you log on and play dodgeball against the other party. I'm going to show you the footage of me logging onto the server and I'll also give you the IP. And then I'm also going to show you my dodgeball game. They gave me a mid tier 3 tester. No I mean mid tier 2 sorry tester, that's just died. Yeah. Anyway, um, I'm not surprised that they got to dodgeball. Okay. Huh? Uh, because oh, so no one can ice dodge anymore then. Bro, what do you mean? Oh, it's no. fine. Make sure you get the RC. Let them shoot. Let them shoot. Don't shoot. Okay, nice. Okay, okay, you got good. this. One, two, three. You got, you got this. this. Oh, one nice. It's doable. It's fine. You got this. Okay. <laughs> okay. <I'm> okay. <laughs> Many peekers lagging a bit. Yeah. Yeah. You just froze on my screen. I probably shouldn't have gone for it. Okay. Guys are stacking here. Nice. Okay, you guys got this. Four barrels. See, Bob, do you want to shoot or no? Nice. Hard as well. It's fine. Yeah, but when you're with three players on such a small platform, it's like nice. Oh, close one. Okay. Nice. Nice touch. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's good. You got this, take your time. Close one. That's fine. Okay, just dodge, it's fine. It's fine. Missed one. Oh, I was ah. gonna go back, but it's fine. Yeah. It only really matters in a. Do you wanna take a cannon? In a cannon, thank you. Do you wanna, do you wanna take? Yeah, sure. I'm gonna shoot one before I get shot. For some reason, I never survived till the end. Nice, penguin. Ah! Oh, uh, watch out! Okay, oh, you missed it, you missed it, you missed it. You missed it. <laughs> wait, that's good. Okay, wait, wait, wait then. I'm gonna take a shot yeah, as well. Yeah. Okay, you can shoot now. Can you shoot? Nice. Oh, I only just missed. I didn't think he'd wait that long. I can't believe my lag is so slightly off. Joy, just take the Let's shot. Go. Yeah, Joy, just be bad over. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Apparently, I missed four shots. And... All right, who wants to take? I'm just I giving you one. That's fine. Before I die. Yeah, that's fair. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> nice hey, shot. There you go. Finally got him. Nice. Just keep taking your time. He's gonna quick shot me. Yeah. Nice. 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 That's good. That's good. You guys got. Nice. You guys got. That was a really good bait. Take your time. Oh, close. That's fine. I made a nice axe. Axe marks as fuck. <laughs> Next one. Really good. Ah. Okay. Two v two. You guys got this. Take your time. Um, nice. nice. Okay, mini pika, 2v1. If he does this, it's nice for him and then GG for him. But you guys touch this, come on. Oh, oh ah. wow, a nice 2v1. Alright, now that pretty much all of the video is over, we'll go on to point number three and how do you get into one of these tournaments? In the description of this video, there were quite a lot of links that are to Discord servers. These are the servers that people host the tournaments in. Now, the top link is to my own tournament server. I host tournaments periodically every three to four weeks, and I'm clearly just better than everyone else, so, you know. If you want to join the biggest and probably the most competitive tournament server, then, um, well, I've got two links that are, uh, you know, probably at the bottom, but, you know, it's worth joining them anyway. The two tournament servers are called ICC and MCCI Champions. And now this is actually the end of the video. All of the footage from the video was streamed live on my Twitch. I'm actually lying, but I will be recording videos on my Twitch. 
and I hope I'll see you in the next video. Have a good day.